Matt Gilmore here with Good Nerd, Bad Nerd. When it comes to shows that combine time travel, horses, the Scots, and World War II, Outlander is definitely in the top five. We're here talking to the cast and crew at Paley Fest. The show has an abundance of horses and whiskey. What kind of experience did you have with those before the show? Um, probably more experience with whiskey than horses, but I say it's a great combo. Have a lot of whiskey and then get on a horse. <laughs> with so many TV shows nowadays based on books, do you think it's caused people to pick up a book they might not have in the past? I do think that, especially when it's a really ripping show where they yeah, they finish the last episode available. They can't wait to see what happens next and they'll go read the book. And they pick fabulous. up the other books for yes. spoilers. Yes, they do. Will your character Lady McTavish maybe show back up again? <laughs> She's not <laughs> in the book. <laughs> your fans have called themselves hooligans. How do you feel about this? Do you feel fit to lead them? Oh, yeah, that is quite a, a challenge. That's but what the people want to know. The people, the people need, uh, the people need hooligans, and uh, they're a, a wonderful team of people. No, their their support has been fantastic. But we have so many amazing fan groups that are out there and have supported us throughout the whole thing. And, and finally, tonight we get to show them you know, this, the first part of season two. I'd love to play a quick lightning round of Jack versus Frank. Okay, Who would win in a fight? Uh, Jack. Who would make a better omelet? Frank. Who would drink more whiskey? Uh, Frank. I Who's think. the better listener? Uh, Jack. Who would win a round of golf? Frank. Uh, who's the better party planner? Uh, Frank. And last of all, who's the better lover? Ooh. It's a tie. They love each other. I think it's I mean, maybe a tie. All right. Good Both very different. I'm Matt Gilmore. Thanks for watching Good Nerd, Bad Nerd. We'll see you next time.